Hundreds of women dressed in pink chanting, our bodies, our choice, crowded in to have their say. Lisa Bluebaugh was a Planned Parenthood patient. A week after I turned 16, I got raped by a coworker. Fortunately, a friend talked me into going to Planned Parenthood to get tested, and they made sure I had the care that I needed. There are 5,287 names on this petition, and it represents the voices of the 74% of Iowans who oppose defunding Planned Parenthood. The measure would cut off reimbursements from Medicaid for any abortion provider. Iowa Right to Life and the Iowa Catholic Conference spoke in support. We recognize that this opportunity provides more women, more choices, and so we're very thankful for you. We believe that life is sacred and a fundamental right and abortion is a direct assault on the lives and dignity of women and children. Senator Janet Peterson, the only Democrat on the subcommittee, argues Planned Parenthood does not receive any government money to perform abortions. The bill takes away uh, health care services from 80,000 women who have been part of the Iowa Family Planning Network. After just 30 minutes, Senator Amy Sinclair recommended it for passage. Senator Schultz, would you like to sign? Well, I'm going to sign. Senator Peterson? Um, we didn't even get to questions on the bill yet. So um, I, I am recommending the bill for passage. Okay. We will be moving it forward. Thank All right. you.